Whether it's local law enforcement or schools, crisis intervention training is a program that anyone on the front lines should have. The whole uh, object is to get the person where there is help. And uh, we hope in most cases that's a hospital so that they can be uh, treated rather than jail. The classes train people how to handle problems with de-escalation skills and strategies. We had different mental health professionals that come in uh, just across the board and try to give them a um, to try to give them some general knowledge of just mental illness as a, as a whole. With tools like VR goggles that take people through real life scenarios. Uh, it's a means for them to look in through the little the goggles and uh, see a situation and they can handle it. You know, it's not hands on, it's like, you know, with eye contact. Although the process is voluntary, Lamar Briggs says it's highly recommended because one decision can change a life. It literally can make the difference between life and death or someone, you know, getting hurt, whether it be the, the individual or the police officer. So being able to, to practice these de-escalation, to, to utilize these de-escalation strategies in these situations is huge because it can make a big difference and usually it does make a big difference. It's not... not Brandon Thomas, ABC 31 News, that works for you.